Now to the hit movie, American Hustle. Its producers under fire right now, facing a million dollar lawsuit for something Jennifer Lawrence's character says about microwave ovens. ABC Cecilia Vega has the story. Who can forget this explosive scene in the movie American Hustle? You know, I read that it takes all of the nutrition out of our food. I read it in an article. Look, by Paul Berdour. Well, Paul Brodeur, a real-life science journalist, is blaming that very scene for scorching his reputation. Bring something into this house that's going to take all the nutrition out of our food and then light our house on fire? Brodeur filing a $1 million libel, slander, and defamation suit against the movie's production companies, including Columbia Pictures, saying the film attributes his name to a scientifically unsupportable statement. Those companies did not respond to a request for comment. He believes a viewer could could come away from that film thinking he doesn't know very much about microwave radiation because character in the film cites him as saying something that is that is not backed up by science. Brodeur has written about the dangers of microwaves, but in the suit says he never declared in any way that a microwave oven takes all of the nutrition out of food. And in fact, he has publicly stated the opposite. Times are hard. The Oscar-nominated film, loosely based on real events, says right there in a disclaimer, some of this actually happened, some, but not all. And that is the point of contention in this lawsuit. Thank God for me. And in addition to that million dollars in damages, Brodeur is also seeking to have his name removed from all copies of this movie. George. Uh, okay, Cecilia, thanks very much. Dan Abrams here right now. Fascinating case. What does he have to prove to win it? Well, look, this is a long shot uh, case. And, and to some degree, you do want to tell him to lighten up, right? I mean, you look at this scene and you say, come on, really? This is that big a deal? Uh, but this is not a frivolous lawsuit, meaning we've seen a lot of frivolous cases filed, including against, uh, you know, the, the, against various movies. Uh, the reason this one is a little bit of a better case is because they name him by name, his real name. They talk about something he actually does cover, which is he had written a lot about microwaves, except he'd never said anything like this. And he says he said the opposite. Exactly. So, so his position is uh, this is clearly false. He says it's defamatory. Uh, the question's likely going to come down to, A, um, did the filmmakers know or should they have known that it wasn't true? They'll probably claim it was effectively a parody based on the particulars of the scene. Um, but it's going to be an interesting case. What's not going to happen is there is no way they're going to end up having to excise his name from all of the films. How does he show that they hurt his reputation? Well, look, he says that people, and he'll have to present evidence that people now believe that he thought this, that he thought that the nutrition was zapped. Um, that can be one of the toughest things, but you first have to get past the first phase, which is showing that you have a legitimate claim before you can actually get to the damages. Okay, we'll watch it, Danny. Right. Thanks very much.